Yuli in Brooklyn, you're live with Stephen A. What's up, Yuli? Hi. So I have saw on Twitter the recent attacks on Mina Khan, which I think it's just bogus how people are attacking Hold on, hold on. That's not right there. What attacks? You got to explain what attacks you're talking about. You said somebody's attacking Mina Kimes? Yes. Well, how? What did they, why, why are they attacking her? When uh, the news came out, she signed a $1.7 million oh, deal. Oh, okay. This, okay. All right. Go ahead. This Twitter account started attacking her and so? is not stopping about it. I'm like, okay, 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 ridiculous. Okay, 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 Yuli, how old are you? 23. Okay, so you're an adult. You're a young adult, right? So I'm not speaking inappropriately. Fuck them. Okay? <laughs> I mean, yeah. listen, man, let me let me tell y'all something, okay? Do you remember when Cat Williams did the stand-up? And he was talking about, I think it was in Cincinnati one time, and he was talking about haters, you need to love your he said if you don't, if you got 15, damn it, you should want 16. You should want 20 of them. You understand? Know Hell with all of them. Let me tell you something, you can't be phased by them. You know what haters really are? People that are upset they're not you or they're not in your position. That's what they really are. Mina Kimes is worthy. I'm telling you as a colleague, she is worthy of $1.7 million a year. If that's what the report says. I ain't getting in her business. But if that's what the report says, Julie, I can assure you, she is worth $1.7 million. Okay? Absolutely. She is absolutely. She is a brilliant mind. She's very smart. She's very dedicated. She's very knowledgeable. And I think she makes good television. Now, I don't appreciate her. And I say this somewhat facetiously because she didn't really do anything wrong. But I don't appreciate her going on Dan Levitard's show and intimating, you know, I'm the boss of First Take. We very much know who the boss is. And so we, as if to imply, they have to monitor what they say or they can't come at me. The theme of First Take is Stephen A. against the world. Everyone associated with that show knows, feel free to come after me. I was raised by five women. I can take it. It's not a problem. Let's go. As long as we don't get personal or disrespectful, come at me anytime, any way you want to. I'm cool. It's not a problem. So I didn't appreciate her implying that it was something other than that. But everybody's got their prerogative.